I have returned. Welcome back to your own channel. Completely missed that dude though. Not for a remix. Here. Remix. Yeah. Fire. I kind of need some Fire. new clips. So, Fire. you know, you want to see something new on the pull screen. Fire. People got to be to uh, making some new clips. Power. But to be fair, it's probably not as easy as it used to be because because um, I don't stream as much. And it makes it a bit more difficult to yeah, I've never been a flip person. Like I think like I'll think like that that was a uh, funny that that, was, that would make a good clip. I, I always forget that you can make clips. Yeah, to be fair, it's not really a feature I use too often to be honest. So um yeah. Uh, I've had a green screen for quite a while now, crazy. Ever since we started playing Kingdom Hearts, I've been using the green screen. Um, did, I did start using it before I took a break as well, so. Yeah, same room. It's his office. I do know it's my office. You've been stalking me? Yep. I know. I know all there is to know about Nock. You're in secret. You don't know yourself. Fire. You, Fire. you know my inner secrets? Fire. I don't know myself. Yes. Fire. That's, that's an ability us Fire. Americans have. Thunder. Maybe we'll um, delve into that a little bit more than in the next podcast, yeah? <laughs> Nope, oh, nope, you can't get that information out of me. Flip seal tight. I want to tell the secrets to the world. Yes, I do, Evan, but I, I, I can't say it. Heal. Yes. Fire. Part of my... What, what I'm obliged to be able to talk about without having to kill people. Just uh, two seconds, Steph. Um, crazy. The um, my just to show you, my my green screen isn't fixed as such. It's just literally you probably can't see from that, but yeah, my actual green screen is um, just like Whoa. just attaches to my chair, so it's not fixed. I just put it up and down each time that I um, uh, stream, so it's not really that weird to be fair. Anyway, continue, Deathwish. Yeah, I always remember when it used to be blue screens. Well, we actually learned about, and me, well, I'd say we, me, we went to Harry Potter Studios yeah. in February. We took um, Evelyn and Ariella there. And we actually learned about um, like green screens there. Um, and they were saying they use green screens for indoor, and they still use blue screens for like nature so if they're doing like okay. outdoor outdoor shots because obviously nature is predominantly green they use a blue screen whereas they use green screens for like indoor stationary stuff because it's a very uncommon color to have indoors or something along those lines so yeah they do still use blue screens okay that makes sense no, I, didn't, um, I didn't know i just thought like way back when, that when they switched to Ozzy Herbert's green screen, I'm like, green screen? What happened to blue screen? But yeah. Get with the times, yes. man. Jeez. Fire. Uh, it folds up, Evan, and I Fire. just store it away when I'm not using it. Fire. Fire. But and a lot of like the ones that, like this one that I've got, a lot of them you can buy and they're dual-sided. 
So one side will be blue and one side will be green. Yeah, so that's, uh, that's a nice feature. <laughs> yeah. The blue screen of death is something I haven't Fire. seen in a very long time. Thunder. I'm not even sure if like the blue screen of death time. is blue anymore, to be fair. It is. Okay. I, I have gotten it once since I got past Fire. Windows 7. And it Fire. was it was so out Fire. of place. Like it's like Windows 98 or Windows to me. Uh, I was like, what? Uh, a blue screen? Death? What? What's going on here? So, yeah. Good night, Revan. Yeah, hey, yeah, have a good night. Good for you. Yeah, do well in school. Remember, you got to show your little sister around uh, your school tomorrow, so rest oh, yeah. well. Show and tell. <laughs> no, um, because Ariella's getting to the age where she's about, well, next year she goes into a final year of junior school. Um, so <clears throat> we're currently looking at. What grade uh, is that? So she's in five at the minute. How old is she? Uh, nine. Okay, so, that would be, fourth, yeah, that would be yeah. fourth grade here. Okay. Well, unless you failed. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, our, you know, our system is similar, Fire. but just we call it different things. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Nine years old, you would typically be in fourth grade. What, what, what do you, all right, this, this is going to sound like a really like, strange thing to say, Fire. but what do your, but what the kids like start at when they like start junior school? Like what class are they in first grade? Uh, we have elementary. So, and it depends on where you are. Like literally, it's not just the state; it's county to county within the state. So, one school could be like back when I went, it was first third elementary school or i mean kindergarten separate they, they had their own building and then you went to a new school Fire. building for third first to third Fire. and then you had middle school which fourth to seventh okay and, and then like in some places had uh junior high which would have been from six through eight typically and then you had high school which is 9 through 12 but my high school was 8 through 12 so Fire. even though like when you're in 8th grade you're in high school Fire. you don't get high school credits per se unless you're in like AP classes and stuff so yeah I was one of the few people that was taking out for one in 8th grade whereas Almost everybody in my class Fire. has been nice Fire. Fire. Yeah, I was kind of Fire. a master nerd back then. Fire. Fire. Nerd. Fire. Came easy and yeah, I was Thunder. eighth grade algebra one, ninth grade geometry, tenth grade algebra two trigonometry, eleventh grade calculus, yeah, Fire. so on. Fire. Fire. Um, can't really answer your question, Fire. Crazy, because I've not really got any experience with um, ray tracing and RTX, but maybe Deathwish can answer your question. Yeah, uh, RTX is great. Uh, if you have, I have an RTX 3060, Fire. but I have to say it's really reliant Thunder. on your. CPU. So, it, it, I mean, it does a good job, but it does a better job if you have a newer, faster CPU. Fire. Uh, and then, and it also depends on the games. 
say some games yeah. just just don't support like TLSS or ray tracing. Yeah, typically your AAA games will. That's where you see benefit, but you really need to have a, a higher end CP, uh, CPU, and, and plenty of hard drive space. Uh, crazy that one of the it, it's like gear food is more expensive than uh, motherboards and <laughs> uh, other things but yeah now nah, you can it, it definitely makes a difference if you have it with a game that supports it so yeah that's that's the thing the game has to support it i mean i i would and this is speaking from somebody who's not got like any experience in, in the matter at all but i mean i wouldn't really say that surely it doesn't make the game experience the experience of the game any better it just makes like the performance and the look and the feel of the game better so yeah it's all about the look the performance sure i mean you could have a 36 ti and that's basically as good sometimes better than a, a 46 yeah so yeah the it's kind of gimmicky the way they number them but, i mean half of the line period is definitely the 4090. yeah uh, but i mean yeah it's super expensive but if you get like a 3060 ti or up i mean i would recommend if you're getting a 30 series that it would be a ti version it costs a little bit more but you get way more bang for the buck yeah like a 30, especially if you get like a 3070, yeah, 3090, you're going to have a, a, a lot better time yeah. you know, running running games at, at higher resolution. That sort of thing. But, but yeah, in my case... Yeah, my old ass motherboard run. This is the RTX 3060. But, uh, being that I have four monitors, one of them is 4K, and that's 55 inch. It tends to be sluggish at times because my CPU is lacking at this point. So old. Yeah. Uh, I'll end up what I'll end up doing it at some point Fire. is building a new PC Fire. and Fire. keeping this one as a secondary Fire. I'm yeah. always done I used to I used to build a new PC about every three years yeah I but remember you saying yeah yeah but it's because games haven't gone to where they used to like when I got this one it would run prices remember that used to be a meme yeah but will it run prices yeah but, but even you know even still yeah you know, nothing's really come out that i can't run for the most part there are some that, that are getting to where i gotta make sure i have nothing else running like i gotta i gotta close all browsers everything just run the game and i can't have it on like max or ultra yeah so, but it still does pretty decent considering it's over a decade old i mean it's probably a good 12 plus now yeah it's it's the first one i've had that's i mean it was high end when i built it but I, I've definitely got my money worth out of it, I'd say. Yeah. Well, um, from what I've heard, though, Starfield's quite an interesting one. Because um, I've heard that more people have had issues with um, their actual hard drives uh, causing the um, game not to work very well than they actually have on graphics and things. Which is quite oh, mad. My nephew bought the game. Yeah, he was playing it on um, your Discord for a bit, wasn't he? Yeah, yeah. And it's 
running like a champ on his dead. Of course, his is a lot newer. He got it about about a year ago ish. Yeah, maybe a little less, but uh, I think he's got a. I think his is a thirty eighty. Can't remember. But yeah, I mean, he can pretty much run everything at uh, ultra settings. For the most part. I don't think it was on your own um, crazy to be fair I think quite a few people had issues with um, bought the RTX portal when it first came out if I remember rightly Fire. Yeah, I don't remember I played it. Everything I, was you tried you tried to play it and I'm pretty sure you're you really struggled with it I did it first and then I found that once I cut um, Got everything out. When I was running and just ran the game, and then it was playable. But I, I, yeah, I couldn't. Fire. I couldn't record Fire. OBS, even though I did. Fire. Anything I ran hurt hurt my yeah. frame rate. Yeah. Because and like I said, mainly because of my CPU Courage. wasn't the, the graphics card. Killing it. I got 32 gigs of memory, so it's not that. And yeah, it, it's straight up the CPU. That, that, that's the bottleneck. Yeah. And I can't put anything higher on this motherboard. So. Yeah, so I gotta. I'm, I can't upgrade any more than I have without just wasting money. Stuff that wouldn't help. I need a new motherboard, new RAM, and I need M.2 drives, and BME, which are obviously far superior. Yep. Yeah. Faster and smaller and everything else, you know. It's like, yeah, those drives are kind of like RAM chips for hard drives. Yeah. Yeah, still, still not quite as fast as Ram, but, you know. Fire. Thunder. But definitely jumped up. Power. I have. I only have one, one or two SSD. No, I have one SSD. <laughs> so I don't have any M.2 drives. Fire. Man, forgive me. Fire. Fire. Yeah, I'm noticing. Um, Fire. I've been noticing like lately Thunder. I thought for a start my internet was like Courage. being weird not uh, it I, I always thought like my provider was throttling me but I think what it comes down to is Power. that no. although I've got like the gigabit connection I don't think one of my dr my main drive where I have um, my like games and everything on is quick enough sometimes to process the data because it's not a solid state drive whereas my operating system drive is so if i download something on steam on my operating system drive it downloads a lot quicker than if i do it on my normal hard drive so rather than being kind of like um network bandwidth restricted it's almost like i'm being hardware restricted on my downloads which is really weird yeah. um so what i've started doing now if i download anything on steam is i tend to download it on my um, operating system drive and then just transfer it across once it's downloaded. Yeah, that makes sense. I do think sometimes over Steam it also depends on like the um, server. game the game that you're downloading and the server as well. Yeah, it's 100% the server and it depends on how big a game it is. The more popular games tend to have faster servers. So, like if, yeah if you pre order like Talos for instance I was getting it it wasn't the fastest that I've ever seen but I mean I've had some games up in the 70s and 80 megabytes per second yeah and those were always like triple-a games even you know even if I got them on I waited and got them on sale like I normally do yeah, I, I don't care oh about my getting, goodness. getting them right away. 
Uh, but yeah, I was getting like 20, 24, 25 megabytes per second on Dallas Pro demo. Yeah. So yeah, it just completely depends on size of game and servers they're on, how much bandwidth they have. Yeah, you could download much smaller games. You, you know, I might only get two or three megabytes per second or sometimes even less. Wow. Yeah, at the same time, like, with some Q, it starts downloading when it's done and it goes boom, 50 megabytes per second. You know? Yeah. So it's, it's, I think it's totally server dependent. What kind of fam what they they allow each connection to have? You see, I didn't know if um, I, mean, I don't know how Steam works, but I didn't know if are those themes like the intermediary kind of middleware that handles all the transactions, whether or not you still connect to kind of like individual servers to download games of like the developers and things, um, or if it is just literally you pull everything from Steam. I don't know yeah, how it works. I, I think don't worry about it, crazy. It's fine. Game. It's fine. Don't worry about it. You can talk as much as you want here. Just have to try and get a word in edgeways from Deathwish. My bad. Pick that up. Let me mute myself. <laughs> Fire. 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 I guess it would be kind of weird, though, if you actually connected to the de like, developer's servers to download it, given that it's on Steam's platform, right? I guess that's kind of Steam's offering, is that you use their their hosting Fire. as a central point to distribute Fire. your application rather than people connecting into your Fire. servers and your networks and stuff yeah, i think a lot of them use Fire. amazon well, yeah they, they do in this day and age for sure Power. Yeah, amazon yeah they, they have so many websites but yeah, just like just like any website hoster, web hoster, you know, server. Yeah. You know, your your bandwidth depends on how much you pay for it. The more you pay, the higher the bandwidth. Yep. And that sort of thing. So yeah, so obviously the smaller games, indie games, well, fortunately are smaller in size, lower to download. Because yeah, they don't have the money to spend Fire. on a fast, high bandwidth server. Otherwise, you know, even if you're selling it, you lose your ass. And yeah, you can, I'm pretty sure, yeah, you can host it. Like Steam will host, host the files, pay them for their servers, and that's cheaper. But yeah, uh, you know, you're getting kind of the same kind of benefits not depending on how much you can afford. so when just to kind of like go back to what you were saying crazy did you did you actually get like play portal prelude then or did you just literally you couldn't play it because of like the graphical issues I see that you said about you was like doing some no clipping going on or something and i'm trying to kind of keep up as much best i can sorry if i've like skipped some of the key details i thought i remember i'm uh posting a video where we played our the portal rtx i don't know about Fire. 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 I'll be mute for about Fire. a minute. All right. Fire. For two secs. Fire. 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 Thunder. Oh, okay. So what was the... So let me just go back up a minute. Um...
You said, you said that you th you just ended up no clipping and switching from level to level to compared to playing because of the issues. That's kind of like made it to me. I kind of made it seem like you were saying that you weren't able to play it because of issues. I guess I misinterpreted what you were trying to say. I'm confused. So what, so what was the comment about then, the no clipping? Felt like I got nothing because it didn't work technically still. So I just ended up no clipping and switched from another to level. Um, I don't know, I'm sorry if I'm not understanding what you're saying. I'm just kind of a bit confused about that comment. I didn't have the bread, but I recall. Fire. It's been hardware based. Thunder. So Power. maybe software based within the hardware. The bone hey, uh, washer is here. What is going on, bone washer? Welcome, welcome. Good to see you, buddy. Glad you're keeping the bones clean. How good's your math, Deathwish? I need to math up to 50. Jeez. How many can I borrow some of your digits? Uh, yeah. I just got a notification that your game library is free. Uh, I think Evan was on Steam, even though he's meant to have gone to bed. <laughs> right, bro. Yeah, busted. <laughs> busted by the American. Boom! shaka <laughs> Um. Out of my... All right, I got to make another 33, so I guess I can use some of my eight cards. 17 to go, 9 to go, oh I use a moogle room because I've got more, multiple of them, alright, story time, the key of guidance. Yeah, it's a card mini game in the card mini game. Looks like we're boss fighting this dude. I'll have a think about a number while I do this boss fight, Death Wish. Yes, sir. Yeah. 
No offense, crazy, but I think you might need to add another digit on that. <laughs> wow, this is the place. Far away, anybody has guessed the time. Okay, crazy. Uh, one digit, not two. <laughs> okay. Guesses are so far from reality. But... Yeah. You lose. Good day, sir. Typically, you're only at, yeah, there you go, 420, that's it. But watch it, because it's um, your first time guessing the Death Wish points, then I'll give you a, a su subtle hint. It will be a five digit number. Power. Yeah, crazy isn't crazy off, but in order to get within 10, it's gonna be much closer. Fire. They don't grow on three. And my official guess, because I, I still, I still not writing this down, Death Wish, which is terrible. I know. I should really write this down. Um, I'm gonna go for sixty-three thousand five hundred and forty-two. Okay. Well, you are typically the closest so far. Okay. I have to but keep her safe. You're about Dominate. the same amount Can off you, you have me? been the last two or three times. Shock. Nominate. It's like you if you would have taken your last guesses and added a certain amount to them, you'd be like almost right on the spot. I must remember to write it down this time, to be fair, when you release the answer, and then I might actually be a bit quicker next time. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're back with story. Sora. I'll reveal the answer after the story. It's you. It's really you. I've been through so much just to see you. Yes, I wanted to see you too. But this isn't right. It must stop. I wanted to see you. But this isn't the right way. Nominate? I was lonely for so long. I just couldn't bear it anymore. So I called out to your heart and had you come all the way out to this place. You came for me and I'm so, so happy, but, but to your heart I had to. Don't worry, I'm here because I promised that I would protect you. Sora, thank you. And I'm sorry. I'm not supposed to be in this picture. That's true. Ugh. Nominee? That isn't me. I'm not there. I don't really exist inside your heart. I don't exist in anyone's heart. I never have existed anywhere. I mean, I'm not real. What? What are you saying? What's gotten into you? Weren't we inseparable? Always together? But then you had to go away. I came here so I'd never lose you again. Was it really me you wanted to see? Of course it was. I know I've forgotten a lot of things in this castle, but never anything about you. <laughs> Look, you gave this to me, didn't you? You have it. My good luck charm. No, Sora. You can't believe me. What am I supposed to do? Think, Sora. Think just one more time. About who's most special to you. Call out to that piece of memory. That glimmers faintly deep inside your heart. No matter how far away the light gets, your heart's voice will always reach it. Who's most special to me? <laughs> That's an easy one. 
It's you, Namit. Kairi, not Namine, surely. That's up to the role master, uh, crazy. Who? Who was that? I can't remember her, but she feels so familiar. Namine? Namine! Is Namine like a fictional part of our memory? Why was that seed planted, I wonder? Hmm. That's interesting. It's almost like the the guys in the castle wanted us to forget about Kairi and implanted something in our memory that wasn't real. You ha you can be on silence now, Dafush. Story time's over for now. Just briefly though. Hello, where am I? You said the your muzzle has been removed temporarily. I heard you. I was just <laughs> so. And if you got anything, I, if you got anything I, to say, I would I would get it off your chest now because we'll uh, be going into another story. You want to go through the store, so ah, uh, oh, jeez, too much story. Well, it's we're wrapping up. We're, we're getting towards the end end game here. I think so. I think that's probably a good reason why. So. Yeah, whatever you might want to say. Get it uh, off your chest, buddy. I have nothing to say. Continue on. From another mother. All right. Story time it is then. Nominee. It isn't you. The person most special to me. It's not you. Right? No. The answer is the girl you really care about. The one who was always with you. It's not me. It's her. But then who, who is she? Because I can't think of her name. If she's so special to me, then why can't I remember? Because I went into your memories and- Let me explain this. Huh? Oh, not Plain Rika again. Simple. Your memory is a train wreck. You're not the one who's meant to protect Naminé. It's supposed to be me! But you and your messed up memories are always in the way. Sora! Oh, jeez. Here we go again. Riku fight number four. Big ass clown shoes alone, man. I can't help it. Get some big ass clowns. Got the most monstrous toes ever. Like, got like, uh, chicken legs. I got my elixir off. That's good. Heal, 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 heal. Whoa, dude. Wow. Wow. 
Ah, oh, Mr. Elixir. Elixir, go off. No, he fucking broke it. That's assault. Don't break it, don't break it, don't break it, don't break it. Just, whew, that was close. That was very close. Oh, nice. Very Sorry. Nice. Back to the story. I'm sure it will be. Hopefully, Riku's freaking dead this time as well. Like, geez, how many more times do I have to fight this guy? Yeah, how many lives do you have? I'm yeah. Oh, show. Freaking cat. Well, he's still stood there. Now he's going to talk to us. Riku! Want some more? Ah! Sora! Riku! Looks like I win. Riku! Stop! You are through! I said stop! Riku? Riku? Riku! What he did looks you pretty do? dead. What did you do to him? Broke his heart. I'd say more like she smashed it, really. Smashed? His heart? Then, what's gonna, what's gonna happen to Riku? <laughs> oh, you're so much fun to watch. If it's a Riku you're worried about, then don't. Because Riku was never really here. What do you mean? Do you really think I'm just gonna say it? That's too easy. <laughs> oh, what to do? Quit the games! <laughs> <sighs> All right. Have it your way, then. I know it'll kill you to hear this, but I think I can live with that. That thing lying there is just a puppet that Vexen made as an experiment. No more than a toy. It's laughable, really. It called you a fake, but it was the fabrication all along. Not Riku, a fake? Fake in every possible way. It was only finished recently. How could it remember anything? You get it? Its memories with Namine were just planted, not real. Yep, that means all this time it's been picking fights with you over memories that were counterfeit, trumped up, and completely bogus. Isn't that the truth, Namine? Oh, so cute. But behind this little face, you do awful things. <laughs> Namine? You're so stupid. Don't you get it now? That's what Namine's powers are about. She can enter, rearrange, and even create new memories of anything, even things that never happened. So what are we saying then? Because I'm tr desperately trying to make sense of this story. Are we saying then that this whole castle is just Namine playing games with people? Removing and rearranging and changing my memories? Is that what we're saying here? Possibly. Rhetorical question. The girl you've been trying to right. protect all this time is really a manipulative witch who shackles people's hearts. There we go. 
my memories are all oh you do get it lies lies all lies just nominees illusions nothing more finding you in the chains of your own memory was central to our trap it makes me tingle to think how easily you were duped so close to it we were almost there this was our only chance to turn the keyblade master into our puppet but that jerk axel he used nominate to betray us hmm. so now i'm left with no choice but to eliminate you you'll pay don't huh it's a little late for the witch to grow a conscience last time i checked you're the one who fooled around with his memories creating this mess i know but hey doctress i should tell you that hey, i'm in an extremely foul mood thanks to you all our plans are ruined thanks nominee what's this are you upset <laughs> And you don't even actually know her. Maybe not. But still, I made a promise. What? A promise I made to Namine to keep her safe. Maybe my memories are fake. Well, hi but the promise is real to me. <sighs> That's why I'll keep it. <laughs> You're such an idiot. There is no promise, and there never was. You're just delusional. Must you insist on playing the hero? <laughs> Whatever. If that's the way you want it, you're going down alone! <laughs> Hey, Donald and Goofy finally caught us up. Of course we did. We were worried about you. And we promised. We promised that we would protect you. Gosh. Gosh. You won't ever be alone. It's always been the three of us, and we stick together. And that is how it's going to stay. Okay. Have it your way. How do you eat? More pain you... for you means more fun for me. Inside your mouth. All right. Here we go. Got a lot of health bars. I'm worried. Fire. Yeah, doctors. Do your thing, man. Have a good night. Bye bye. Yeah, no worries, doctors. Thanks for uh, just dropping by and saying hi. It means a lot. Take care and um, good night. Right. Um. How much more? I've got another capacity for 75 card points here. <clears throat> What's your advice, Deathwish? What do you think? Uh, press some buttons. X. Okay. I mean, come on. What else are you gonna do? You got you got to you're using the controller. Press buttons. Kill. Excellent. 
Walk around or run. The text to speech in preludes? Uh, no, I don't think I do. Yeah, no clue about that. I don't think I ever played it, to be honest. I recall. So. My memory is crap, so. <laughs> can't, can't rely on my memory. Ooh, that could be interesting. Some tracks two from the reload counter. That could be interesting. But then so could that stop the reload counter from counting reloads. is though like now with this game i feel like i've i've played for such a long time now with a magic build that trying to do this any other way is going to be tricky for me which is not good now's the time to insert run dmc's classic tricky it's tricky hey, hey, it's tricky Tricky, 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 tricky. Something, something, something else. Something, something, something else. It's tricky. <laughs> you, you nailed it, man. You nailed it. I bet that should be a clip. <laughs> <laughs> All right, somebody clip it. Uh, I need 23, not 24. Fifteen. All right, we can use that. I could use eight on there. Okay. Oh wow! I cleared all the mini games. Jeez, that's interesting. Didn't expect to have cleared all them. All right, take two. Uh, I no idea how many cards I have. Um, crazy. Deathwish, thank you for the hundred bits. What? Lightning. Goofy, your time. Thank <laughs> you. 
No, she cancelled my... Come on, Oogie. Give me some... She healed. My fair. He keeps healing. I'm thinking I shouldn't use lightning against her because she's finding a lot of lightning attacks, so I think she's probably resistant to lightning. Yeah, she's... Dear ostrich Pete, <laughs> Real tie. I am dead. All right, so we need to take out magic, uh, lightning magic here because she is resistant to it. I'm pretty sure. Seems like it. Yeah. Normally the way that when they use like a certain element, they are immune to it, so. Yeah, that seems to be the running deal. So here. we will. Whatever, whatever their main thing is, then you can't use it against them. Yeah. Which makes sense. I mean, you know, they can use it. They're. They don't have defense. I mean, their de their defenses are auto. Yeah. So you have sorry, sorry, Deathish. Um, you have oh, three. Yeah. You have three decks, crazy, because you can actually have three different loadouts kind of to, to set up. You only use one at a time, but you reload them using various means. So you can either manually reload them or use a special item card which causes them to reload as well so yeah depending on what it is you are trying to do and how quickly you want your cards to come back will be depend on um which one you select to use i don't know if that made any sense at all i was just kind of rambling to be honest Well, that's right, that card allows me to reload while I'm walking around, so probably need to put that into perspective as well. Um, okay, I need to take a bathroom break. So we'll have Ooh. a pause. Um, and I'll uh, have a think about what guests I'm going to go with Death Wishes uh, guest, uh, guest the points very soon while I'm away. So uh, yeah, I'm going to have a quick break. I'll be right back and we will uh, jump straight back into another round of boss fights. So uh, stay tuned guys. I will be back. <laughs> <laughs> 